morning, everyone. It is day two of MLG, and I am hanging out with none other than Wild Turtle. Was that, that was, what was that? That was the, the small eye shoot thingy. The small eye shoot thingy. Love it. So we're up in the press room, and uh, I'm going to be doing some interviews. This is the view from the press. Let's see. Here's a better non-windowed version. Oh, it's so loud. So loud. What if I dropped my camera? Oh. I was worried you were going to walk up from behind me and scare me, and I was going to drop my camera. I feel like that's something you would do. I would never hold anything. Anything I want out there. Oh! You That's don't so want your scary. hands? That's so scary. Oh my gosh. You could have dropped your phone. Your yeah. Snapdragon. Oh my gosh. That's oh so my scary. gosh. When do you play, Turtle? 9 p.m. 9 p.m. Who are you playing against? Kirsten. Oh. You're going to win? TSM Snapdragon. You're going to win? Just going to win. TSM Snapdragon. You've heard it here. Is going to win. That game. So, I don't know. Do you want to explore? Probably just no. staircases. <laughs> Probably nothing worth looking at. So, anyways, I, this is my little interview setup. It's really cool. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna get to interviewing and I will catch up with you guys in a little bit. Right now, I am at Starbucks with none other than Pikachu. Still hanging out with uh, at Pikachu, Wild Pikachu. Get it? Get it? See? Haha. <laughs> Okay, yeah, no. Okay, all right, whatever. Anyways, so we are getting some, uh, you got very, very hibiscus. And I got Valencia orange. And I, I got the orange because I have a cold right now. And I figured there might be some vitamin C in the orange. Yeah? Yeah? No, no. So um, I just did some interviews. I interviewed Crawley. And I'm gonna interview a couple other people from the amateur scene later. So that's gonna be interesting. Um, this is a really cool mug. I like it. It's like the handle's a heart. Half a heart. Half, half, half far. Yeah. Yeah, turtle. That's what I mean, yo. It's your birthday. Happy birthday, Kobe. Do you want me to sing you happy birthday? No, people have already been doing that. It's okay. Oh, okay. I mean, yes. No, it's all right. I'll let you get back to signing your autographs. This is what uh, a lot of the casters and players do at MLG. They sign lots and lots of autographs and take lots of pictures. So, as you can see, Rivington over here, he's just signing away. He's just such, wow, you're so cute. All right, so I'm gonna uh, just walk around for a little bit. Uh, I don't know if I'll be able to see anybody that you guys will know. Probably if I head up towards this area, maybe. It's a little dark. Cloud9 just dominated CLG. It was a very exciting match to watch, and I'm very glad that I was here to watch it. The crowd is uh, so very full today. So many freaking people. I love that the casters are just like up here on this like higher than everybody else podium where they cast the games. And yeah, so. Everyone's just, this is the signing area where lots of people sign. Oh, I found Jamaica again. Oh, she's about to get her picture taken. She's a supermodel with Zuna. Wow, they're so swole. They're so swole. They lift. Wow. Those are some really cute pictures right there. Woohoo! Um, I think for now, I am just going to sit down and watch the next match right now. My friends Cloud9. Oh, look at them. Oh, they're signing so much stuff. Look how popular they are. Look at all these people. Yeah, but in your cat. Better here. Yeah. And this is like the short line. There's been a long line. They've been signing stuff for a really long time now. And right now some of the amateur teams are playing and I'm not sure who's playing. I can't see because they're not up there anymore. All these basketball players showed up at MLG and I'm like, what the heck, who are these people? They're super tall and beautiful and sculpted and like very not gamer-like. So they're over there, I don't know if you can see. Like right here and right here. And uh, I would try to get closer, but as you can see, there's a, a mob of 
people that are trying, I guess, to take pictures with them. But it was really cool. So I was like, oh my gosh, they have security guards all over them, and they're obviously famous. And one of the guys over there, he's got to be at least like seven five. Like that guy is probably the tallest human being I've ever seen in my entire life. So, anyways, uh, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys cool basketball player mob scene thing. All right, so it is the end of the day, and I am exhausted, and I think everyone is exhausted here, too. Hold it. I can hold the camera. What? I can hold the camera. Oh, no. I, I'm okay holding you got it. This. I do this every day. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, oh, that's the uh, authenticity, right? I, I it's such a true catalytic thing to do. I guess I guess it is. Awesome. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> um, I'm here with Claude Nine now, and we are getting ready to eat. Balls, are you really tired? I can see it in your face. You're so sleepy. You're gonna fall asleep on the bench? Probably. Probably. Yeah. Um, whoa! I just saw like this glowing thing fall from the sky. What the heck? That was so cool. I want one. But uh, anyways, we're exhausted. Gonna eat, and I'm gonna go and see you guys tomorrow. Bye.